with a weather forecast like that, we all rely on that AC unit to keep us cool in these brutal times. But if you need something fixed right now, good luck. As THV 11's Ian Russell explains, repair companies are seeing a backup for several reasons. Air conditioning technicians are doing their best to get to everyone as quickly as they can. But with summer feeling like it came earlier this year, one air conditioning company owner tells me that those companies are just doing their best to keep up. The song of the summer is here. Your AC unit doing its best to keep you cold. Those units aren't the only ones working to keep up, though. The techs who work on them are just as busy. Right now, we are as busy as we can possibly be. Dan Chapman knows how busy summers are for your AC unit. This is peak season for him. Started out about a month and a half ago at about 100 calls a day. We're down to about 65 a day now. And it's harder than ever to keep up. Obviously, we can't get to everyone. We try to take care of our service contract customers first and then help everyone else out. It's not for lack of trying, though. Chapman says he and all the other companies out there are trying their best to handle that summer wave of calls, but things are tough right now. It doesn't help that it feels like summer came early. We saw it come in about a month and a half early, and we're usually doing our spring checkups right now, and we don't have time to do as many spring checks up as we are taking care of no air conditioning at all. And the fact that their industry is also seeing shortages, both on parts and people. I talked to 30 or 40 companies at a time, and everyone is having a shortage of workers. They're just not out there for the trades. Chapman says they're having to schedule people for further out just so they can even be seen. In the meantime, he says they're offering window units to people to at least keep them cool from that summer sun. So if you need AC work done, there are some basics that Chapman recommends. I would recommend that they get the first person that can get to them. Now that may not be the best person, but at least somebody can come out and look at the problem. If it's an easy problem, they can get it fixed. If it's something a little bit more technical, then they'll probably have to call us. In North Little Rock, Ian Russell, THV 11 News.